Hello everyone, welcome to the Network Security Algorithm series. Today we'll be doing the RSA algorithm. This algorithm is used to generate the public and private key for any one. This algorithm is based on the asymmetric key cryptography. So in asymmetric key cryptography, any of the entity, it has to generate a public and private key. There are various algorithms to do that. One of the algorithm is the RSA algorithm. So today we'll see how this algorithm can be used to generate a public and private key. So let us consider we have an entity Alice, okay, and she wants to generate a, a, a private and public key pair. So how does she do this using the RSA algorithm? So we'll see very stepwise. The very first thing is she will first of all select two large prime numbers P and Q. Okay. She will select these numbers P and Q, a very large prime number and then she will calculate the value of n such that this n is equal to multiple of P into Q. Then next step what she will do is uh, she will uh, find the value of phi of n such that this is equal to P minus 1 into q minus 1 this is the second step then uh, she will select e okay, the value of e okay. now this selection of e is uh, such that this e lies between is greater than of course 1 but less than this phi n which we have already calculated and of course e must be a co prime one more condition is e must be a co prime of phi n okay. and then she goes to the next step where she computes d such that this d is e raised to minus 1 and mod of phi n so now as we can see we have calculated some parameters some numbers okay now out of these numbers we can see that uh, the what is the public key out of this number so let us see the public key the public key in this whatever calculations we have done the public key is e n okay where this is e and this was n which we already done these are these are the public key and the private key okay i will write it by uh, green marker so this is the private key the private key is of course D. Now in this particular case Alice will share her public key E N N through this particular unreliable channel. Okay. So this E N N they are known to everyone. Okay. E N N these are known to everyone, even the attacker. But this D is kept secret. D is not given to anyone. So this is the this D is the private key. Now suppose uh, if Bob wants to and to send a secret message to Alice, what he will do? He knows the public key of Alice, so he can use this this two key, encrypt the message and send it to Alice to the ins unsecure, unreliable media. Now because this message was encrypted using Alice's uh, public key, it can only be decrypted by Alice's private key. No other key can decrypt the message okay so this is how it can uh, provide the security that the message will be confidential eve cannot if if eve is an attacker she cannot decrypt the message because she does not has alice uh, private key so the message is encrypted by this can only be decrypted by alice private key okay. now account uh, now we can also use a concept of digital signature the, the what does this say that if Alice wants to send a message and she wants to provide authenticity that it is only sent by Alice no no one else so she can uh, sign the message using her own private key and this message can be delivered to Bob and because this was signed or we can say encrypted or signed by Alice's private key it can only be unsigned or decrypted by Alice's public key so this is how digital signature works so this was the simple explanation regarding the working of RSA algorithm. Now how to implement this algorithm, this will be done, this will be explained by Professor Yasira.
थैंक यू ओके स्टूडेंट सो टूडे वी वी आर गोइंग टू इम्प्लीमेंट दी आर एस ए प्रैक्टिकल विद द हेल्प ऑफ पाइथन सो ओवर हियर वी आर गोइंग टू यूज लाइब्रेरीज दैट इज पाई क्रिप्टो डोम नाउ सी स्टूडेंट देर आर मेनी लाइब्रेरीज अवेलेबल इन पाइथन फॉर इनक्रिप्शन एंड डिक्रिप्शन ऑफ अ मैसेज बट टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू यूज अ वेरी अमेजिंग लाइब्रेरी दैट इज पाई क्रिप्टो डोम नाउ बेसिकली सी स्टूडेंट्स जो आर एस ए एल्गोरिदम है दैट बेसिकली प्रोवाइड्स की जनरेशन दैट इज इट विल जनरेट अ रैंडम प्राइवेट की एंड पब्लिक की कैन यू सी ओवर यूर आई हैव रिटर्न की पैर आर एस ए डॉट जनरेट एंड ब्रैकेट में वन जीरो टू फोर सो बेसिकली दिस की पैर जनरेशन दिस पर्टिकुलर लाइन इज गोइंग टू जनरेट द रैंडम प्राइवेट की एंड पब्लिक की दैट इज दी साइज वी हैव टू टेक फ्रॉम वन जीरो टू फोर यू कैन टेक इट टिल फोर जीरो नाइन सिक्स बिट सो दिस इज वन ऑफ द वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट ऑफ दिस अल्गोरिदम द नेक्स्ट पार्ट इज द इनक्रिप्शन नाउ स्टूडेंट्स इट विल इनक्रिप्ट अ सीक्रेट मैसेज दैट इज ओवर यूर कैन यू सी ओवर यूर द मैसेज आई हैव प्रोवाइडेड इज द आई स्माइल अकेडमी सो दिस पर्टिकुलर अल्गोरिदम विल देन इनक्रिप्ट अ सीक्रेट मैसेज दैट विद द हेल्प ऑफ द पब्लिक की and it will decrypt it back using the secret key and the very important part over here is the digital signature the rsa algorithm basically provide this digital signature that is it signs the message using the private key and it will verify the message signature using the public key and then students the key exchange this it will securely transport a key which is used for encrypted communication so before starting to run this program in python do not forget to install the library and how can we do that students we have to go to command prompt and we will install from here with the help of pip pip install and the library pi crypto do this is the library which we are going to use for the rsa a uh, key pair generation algorithm so can you see it has been already installed on my system so it is telling me requirement already satisfied now we will be moving on to the code so the code over here is basically first we had installed the pi crypto dome uh, module now as we are using the rsa algorithm students we will have to import it from the crypto dot public key do remember this line basically uh, from crypto dot public key import rsa this is very important we are using rsa algorithm so we will have to import it so from where we can import it from the crypto dot public key then students we are using the oaep padding scheme so we have to import that from from the crypto dot cipher so this is the next important uh, module which we will be using and at the end students we will have to convert the binary to ascii so we have imported bin bin ascii and then students over here as i told you we are going to generate the key pair so key pair public key and private key generate karne ke liye we are going to make use of this rsa dot generate and kitne bits ka we are using value 1024 after we are done generating the key pair value we will generate the public key value so for generating the public key value key pair dot public key key pair mein public key aur dono aa gaya ab public key humko chahiye so key pair dot public key will be save in the pub key and uh, the private key will be in the priv key pan can you see over here so once we have generated the public key we will enter a message that is to be encrypted so message i have provided over here and using encrypt function we will encrypt the message so we will just see the uh, execution of this particular program so can you see students uh, this is the public key and then this is the private key and then it is encrypting the message so we have discussed uh, about rsa uh, encryption implementation using python so students do not uh, forget to install the very important library that is the pi crypto dome which is required for the rsa key generation thank you